Welcome back, Tiger Nation. Today is Wednesday, November 17th. What do you call a pig that does karate? What? A pork chop, baby. What? That was funny, man. Let's go to Seth with today's lunch. Don't you guys think that was funny? For lunch today, we'll be having pasta with meat sauce, garlic toast, Normandy vegetables, romaine salad, and an applesauce cup. Let's head back to our main desk with Corin and AZ. Corin, why did the bike fall over? Why? Okay, ready for this one. It was too tired. <laughs> Let's head to Trinity and Kendall for our Thursday extras. That's a knee slapper right there. Dress. Tickets will be on sale at lunch for the fall play until November 17th. The fall play is Steel Magnolias. Tickets are $5 and will be available to all grades. The show will begin after attendance has been taken for a period of that day. You can also buy tickets online at Central's box office where tickets for sporting events and social events. Please come support Central's theater department. This week, the Stewart Council will be kicking off a donation drive for the Ronald McDonald House. We will be collecting travel-sized toiletries such as deodorant, toothpaste, shampoo, conditioner, body wash, and soap. Stop at the store this week to pick up some of these items. This week, you will take these items to your Tiger Time teacher. The Tiger Time that collects the most items per student will win free Chick-fil-A. Attention juniors, make sure you fill out the prom theme Google form. This is on the class of 2024 Google Classroom and was sent to your infinite campus. Tired of the same boring day? Want to try something new? Want to add some inches to your vertical? Come out to Volleyball Open Gym starting Thursday, November 3rd from 7 to 9 p.m. in the Fieldhouse. Every year we have multiple seniors come to, a, to open gyms and say, I wish I had played sooner. Don't let this be you. Come give it a try. We guarantee you'll have good time. All are welcome and we encourage new people to come play with us. You could either, even bring a younger sibling along if they're a boy in 7th and 8th grade at Ridgeview. 7th and 8th graders will be invited too. Let's, be ha let's head back to the main desk. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Kendall. I'm one of the 10th grade representatives on Stewart Council. And I'm here to tell you that today we will be going around to Tiger Times collecting monetary donations for our toiletry drive that will help the Ronald McDonald House. Thank you, Kendall and Trinity. We want to hear from Tiger Nation. There will be a QR code that will lead you to a Google form at the end of Tiger News. Scan it and fill out the Google form. Let's go over to Mr. Wells and the question of the day. Make it a great day, Tigers. Okay, recording. Hey, good morning, Tiger Nation. Uh, Monday, we uh, really covered our first core value of trust. And I asked the question is, what does trust look like? How, what does it feel like? And why is it important? My question, uh, we're going back to trust today, is once you have lost someone's trust, let's say your teacher's trust or your boyfriend's or girlfriend's or even just a friend, what are some things you can do to gain someone's trust back? So my question for you is once you've lost trust with someone, what can you do to regain that trust? So what can you do or what can you show to regain trust with a teacher, with a friend, and the relationships? I look forward to hearing about your strategies and some things you can do to earn back your trust. Let's have a great Thursday and go Tigers. Interested in being part of the skit for the Black History Month production? Auditions are next Tuesday after school. Check the BHM Google Classroom for roles and more information.